My name is Anthony Williams. I work for the Royal Society of Chemistry in the Chem Informatics team, and we have responsibility for the ChemSpider database that we provide to the community. Over 28 million chemical compounds linked out to 400 data sources across the web. In this case, what I've done is a search on Taxol, <clears throat> and it shows the chemical structure of Taxol and lots of related information. One of the things that we've done over the years is utilize the Google API. In this case, we're showing the Google Books. We've been able to hit the Google Books API to show that information. We've also integrated to the Google Patents. So here we see the Google Patents tab. And also we've got we've linked up to Google with a number of Google uh, searches. So from the ChemSpider searches tab, we can search Google Scholar. If I click on that, I see Google Scholar. The way this works is that we've taken uh, a lot of pain to make sure that all the associated synonyms for Taxol are integrated and approved, and we pass these over to the API to do the searches. What you will have seen, however, is that for a ChemSpider record, there are a series of info boxes. ChemSpider is very powerful, large amount of data, it's been integrated across multiple data sources, but in some ways, one might say, a little bit complex. If all you want to do is get the best value out of the Google APIs, maybe there's an alternative. So what we've built, and we'll be showing at the ACS in Philadelphia, is ChemSpider Google. That's what we've called it for now, just our internal project name. Imagine that I come to an interface, and I want to search on something like aspirin type in aspirin, I convert, there's the chemical structure. I could just as easily draw the molecule here because this is a sketcher. I could upload a mol file here. Whatever, whatever the compound is, when I've got it, I can do a search. And here we see the results. We have aspirin. We've got the link to the ChemSpider full record, so everything that we have, all the power of all of the work that we've done over the years, is sitting there right under the ChemSpider ID. Again, I can search on Google Scholar, as I've already shown, but now we've given you four simple tabs. Searching the web for aspirin, searching for patents, searching the books, and searching on images. The way we've done this is simply find all of the associated synonyms, for aspirin and pass them out to the Google API. We hope you'll check it out. It's very much work in progress, but we think it will be a very, very easy way to access the Google APIs through a simple interface. Enjoy.